My name is Daniel Cowan. I'm one of the co-founders of 3D. So I have two business partners, Max and Pete. And Max and Pete were designing toy products. I'm Maxwell Bode, uh, the CEO of Wobbleworks. Peter Dilworth and myself uh, were doing quite a number of creations and inventions at the time. And one day the 3D printer actually made a mistake on a 14 hour print and it uh, missed a layer. Dilworth was like, man, I wish you could just reach over, grab the printer head and fill in the missing spot and I'd put it back. I said, Why can't you do that? The next day we took apart our 3D printer and uh, created the world's first 3D pen. 3 Doodler is the world's first 3D printing pen. We launched in 2013 and we produce a pen that literally lets you draw in the air. So we ran two crowdfunding campaigns, we worked with Kickstarter to raise awareness and get a lot of buzz behind what is still a very new and exciting product. We were amazed and humbled about the sheer scale. It was phenomenal and it happened very quickly. Since then it's been a roller coaster. We went from you know, on day one, having no one know about the 3Doodler, to overnight having half a million dollars in backing and tens of thousands of people supporting us. 3Doodler being used by architects who are creating sketches in 3D, it's been used by fashion designers. Um, it's also useful to make everyday use objects. For example, my, my wallet is made using the 3Doodler and our new flexi plastic, the, my iPhone case. It's truly limited by your imagination. When you first run a crowdfunding campaign, you can't think of everything. There's a lot of things you plan for, but you never know the exact shipping cost. You don't even know necessarily where you're shipping from. You know, when you have 26,000 backers and you're shipping out all of that product, it becomes quite a nightmare. It's not something that you can just do yourself. And then we had the challenge of working out how to ship them out and get them into consumers' hands cost-effectively. It was difficult. So we started off using Dispatcher because we just needed to ship these Kickstarter pens out. Can we also do this for our e-commerce buyers? And at that point, we were running our own e-commerce platform. We were very happy that ESG came along and uh, aided us with that process. So then we started working on Expander and having ESG run everything from checkout through to fulfillment and customer service. As a partner, they've truly been a partner. They've helped us not with just our website and not just with helping getting shipments out, but to grow and expand our business into new areas. And it's grown month by month from there. Uh, we now work with ESG on marketplace rollout under Expander as well. So it'd be great to have a logistics partner like that who can bend with you and come up with new ideas on the fly and be able to implement them in a reasonable amount of time. We now sell in 35 countries directly. And then through e-services, we sell in, I think, 180 is the reach we have. ESG has done a fantastic job of uh, simplifying and streamlining our logistics. And to date, we've shipped about 400,000 pounds.